So my name is Mark Miller. I'm a Lucene Solar Committer, and uh, I work for Lucid Imagination uh, doing development. So the REST API is an interface to uh, LucidWorks Enterprise that you can access over HTTP. Um, it uses standard REST conventions. You uh, get, put, delete, um, post uh, various commands. And it basically lets you control all of the configuration and options in LucidWorks that the admin UI would let you control. But it makes it so that you could script it so that you could do it remotely. Um, you're on one server, you want to talk to another server, you just send over an HTTP call. You can change settings, you can kick off indexing jobs, you can create new data sources. So it basically gives you full remote access to everything that you might do in our admin UI. Um, instead of going through the admin UI and adding all your data sources and doing all the configuration you want and, and having to you know, if you ever started from scratch or, or you have another developer who wants to, to, to do a similar setup on his system, you can program, you can script everything through the REST API rather than using the UI so that it's replayable. And so you set everything up, you see how it works, um, you go to another machine later, you want to do the same thing but make a few tweaks, you just replay your script and it, it's basically just like recording what you would do in the admin API, uh, UI and playing it back. Right, so if, if you're working with a cluster of say 100 machines and they all share the same schema and, and configuration and you want to make a change, normally you're going to have to go to each machine, go to the UI on each machine and make that change. Uh, going to 100 machines, that's obviously going to take you a while. But with the REST API, you could script it so that the, the URL just changes on each call and you make one call to each of the machines with a little script and update your config to be the same. Right now we have shared configuration. Um, so again, if you're running 100 machines, normally each one will have a separate configuration that you'd have to go edit if you want to change something. But with cloud, the configuration all sits in one place in Zookeeper so that all of the machines can read it from one place and you make changes in one place and it automatically goes to all of your servers. We have built-in load balancing now. Um, instead of having to go and, and get some load balancing hardware or find a software solution and, and become a load balancing expert and set that up, that's all built in now. You just specify what servers you have and uh, LucidWorks will automatically load balance incoming queries across those servers in a round robin fashion um, along with automatic failover. So if one of those servers goes down and there's another server up with identical content, LucidWorks will automatically stop trying to hit the down server and instead hit the server that's up, occasionally pinging the server that went down every you know, n seconds so that if it does come back up, it comes back into rotation. So we want to improve the elasticity so that it's very easy to add or remove servers and everything just automatically adjusts. Uh, if all of a sudden you're getting a high query load that you can't handle, you just fire up a new box, it joins the cloud, and there's really no work to, to set it up. It's all automatic. We want to work on fault tolerant indexing so that if you're indexing and the, and the machine, the master that you're indexing to goes down, um, another machine automatically takes its place. Uh, we want to make it so that when you index a document and you get a response that it was indexed, it's guaranteed that that a document is in the cloud somewhere. We're also working on better setup in cloud environments like EC2 so that you can just fire up LucidWorks AMIs, fire up 10 of them, they automatically discover each other and you've got a cloud going with zero configuration 